Removing structure definitions from drawings. If you are going to be sending files to a non-mechanical user and your files have structure in them, you may want to remove the structure definitions before sending them out. The reason for this is that if an AutoCAD user tries to make a change to a structure item, such as if they would explode it and then remove some geometry, add additional geometry, trim, etc., and then save the file and that file's brought back into Mechanical, Mechanical will reinstate the structure definition so all of the AutoCAD changes will be lost. Now this can be used to your advantage if you don't want the structures to be changed, but the AutoCAD user would still believe that the changes had taken place. First, I will change to the Structure Workspace so the Mechanical browser is visible. The tool to remove structure is the explode command, which is actually AM explode. So this not only will explode polylines into lines and arcs, but it will remove the structure from a drawing. You get a message box saying that the instances of these items have been deleted. Would you like to delete the definitions as well? Press Yes. And now those are individual AutoCAD objects. A standard Part 2D will look like a block to a regular AutoCAD user, though it will bring up the Proxy Objects dialog box when the file is opened in regular AutoCAD. Another technique that could be used to remove all the structure from a drawing file is to save the file back to an earlier release format. By saving the file back to AutoCAD Mechanical Release 6, you're saving to a version that existed before structure, so no structure elements are saved. The downside is that you lose newer AutoCAD functions such as fields and tables. So the file can now be sent to somebody who's running regular AutoCAD they will not have any structure objects to deal with. Any changes that they make will be retained. 